dump it. This drama really means nothing to me. I ride by and blow your brains out. Brains out. It's no time. How's it going guys? This is Doodle and I haven't made a video in a long time because my computer actually was down for a while and before I even start this video I wanted to say I am really sick right now and that's why my voice sounds terrible. I uh, actually inhaled some like sawdust or wood chippings at work and uh, it's causing all kinds of problems but anyways this video is a 59 kill challenge on sandbox and when I first started this gameplay I had no really intention of even trying this on this map because uh, this map isn't really good in my opinion and I don't know I feel like it wouldn't have been a good one to go for it on but as the game progressed I was like you know what worst case scenario I back out I can't join back or I just I join back and I don't win that's nothing bad's gonna happen obviously um but I ended up going for it and it was surprisingly success surprisingly successful um when I left, I think the kid in second place has, I think, 14 kills, something like that. And that's obviously not really a good number to leave on. They're, you know, they're almost halfway. Why would I back out of that one? And I was like, you know, what? I'm just going to go for it. And then I end up having, I couldn't get back into the game as soon as I, I liked to. I couldn't join at first. There was, I don't know what the deal was, but couldn't get back in and I, I almost gave up I tried to join a free-for-all match and I checked one last time on the recent players I ended up getting back into the game and when I joined back the first place kid had 18 kills and he was pretty sweaty he he was doing pretty good with the grease gun so I wasn't my hopes were too high um, but I ended up going for it and I ended up being su successful but uh, my friend Grant uh, told me to go for this and originally I was really hesitant because in this game it's a lot harder to join sessions again like on MW2 or 3 or BO2 you know you can easily back out click X or square whatever it would be and you can join quick and then there's a lot a lot less downtime uh, for some reason on this game a lot of the new cards or whatever it may be there's like a like a delay in the lobby when someone leaves or I don't know there's just some kind of problem with that but I ended up getting back into the lobby surprisingly and it it worked in my favor um it was a pretty close game the second game i joined back obviously the kid had 18 kills not a lot of time to work with um i started the first game obviously with the, the end field and as i joined back i'm like i might as well use the lever action a little bit quicker i know it wasn't the same gun i used in the first game but i was like i have a lot of catching up to do and this kid is cruising through the kills so i'm just going to use the lever action but they're both iron sight so it's not too big of a deal but just want to clarify that I did know I used the wrong gun not that there's a rule on doing a 59 kill challenge with the same gun but I just wanted to touch on that so I'm going to leave it at that um like I said my voice is pretty shitty right now so I don't really want to talk too long the more I talk the more I cough so um I'm gonna leave it at that right now I'm at 22 kills about to get 23 so um, this video is a little bit longer, obviously I have to show all the, the in-between joining and stuff, so it's legit. Um, but I hope you guys enjoy, hope you guys have a good Monday, and I'll see you guys later. And, uh, also a couple more things I forgot to mention. This audio is recorded on my iPhone because my blue snowball is no longer working because I thought it'd be a good idea to try to force the cord into the back of it. And, uh, my prongs weren't lined up in my plug, so I ended up bucking it up myself my fault um i wasn't too upset though because i've had that snowball for a long time um since i made my first bo2 commentaries when i've had that thing so i'm um, not too upset about that obviously it's a little bit inconvenient and then also um i watched a lot of actually i watched a lot of vid videos like this yesterday where i watched a couple of 59 uh free-for-all challenges 59 kill free-for-all challenges yesterday and uh, everyone I watched, they were using lethal streaks, you know, I'm going to be two or three, they had payloads, IMS, like, just like little, little streaks like that where they're getting kills. And I just think that's so, it just defeats the purpose. So I made sure that I, I obviously still have a UAV and a counter UAV and flat guns in this video, but there's nothing else outside of my, my gun getting me kills, which I think is a lot more accomplishing, I guess, to get to get this challenge done with and calling in streaks and ruining it but um i don't know let me know what you guys think i try to make it more more legit i can try going for it and try going for it without even a uav um i don't think it'd be too much of a problem 
Um, but let me know if you guys want to see that too. I can try for that. I have been enjoying World War II a lot lately, and uh, it's kind of refreshing, honestly, having fun playing COD again. So let me know what you guys want to see, and I'll try to make it happen. I do want to make a big, a big video at some point too, but I feel like I always say that and never follow through with it, especially since World War II is hit or miss for lobbies, and MWR is completely dead for free for all, so not a lot of options. BO4, uh, it's fun to play. I don't like it, like really sniping on it too much, but it is it is fun now and then, but I don't know. Um, let me know what you guys want to see, and I'll try to make it happen.